As a lab officer in the Air Force, we aren't single disciplinary scientists. You have to be skilled in a range of disciplines, such as haematology, biochemistry, coagulation, and microbiology, to assist the doctor in diagnosis of the patient. Both my parents were in the military. Um, my mum was a clerk and my dad was a flight engineer. They both really enjoyed it, thought it was a great career opportunity. I knew I always wanted to join the Air Force, but I just never thought that I would find a career that would fit my desires. However, through contacts that my dad had, I found out that a laboratory officer was available in the Air Force, which allowed me to follow my passion for science, but also join an organisation that I have always wanted to join. As a normal laboratory officer, you would automatically think of a little science geek sitting behind a microscope and not really getting out and discovering new opportunities. However, in the Air Force, it gives you the opportunity to do different things such as abseiling or leading a group of people through the bush and just allowing you to develop skills that you would never get to use in a normal civilian lab. We also have the opportunity to deploy in a laboratory overseas and that can be supporting a Navy ship, a field hospital or you could be next to an air base um, supporting Air Force personnel. I definitely believe that we make a difference. Laboratory officers form a key part of healthcare. Healthcare is a force multiplier. We keep the jets flying, we keep the troops marching and healthcare is an essential part to make sure they are safe and healthy. My name is Sam and I'm a laboratory officer in the Air Force.